Based upon provisions of IRC 6 2017, here's an elaboration of the table comparing SV loading, that is special vehicle loading, with non-SV loading based on different parameters. 1. Total axle load. In SV loading, the total axle load is 385 tons. This represents the extreme loading conditions typically used for evaluating bridge structures under heavy special purpose vehicles. However, in non-SV loading, two standard loadings are considered. Class 70R loading, having total axle load of 100 tons, and Class A loading having total axle load of 55.4 tons. 2. Length of vehicle. In SV loading, the vehicle length is 38.459 meters. However, in non-SV loading, two standard vehicle lengths are considered. Class 70R loading having vehicle length of 13.4 meters and Class A loading with vehicle length of 18.3 meters. 3. Impact and congestion effects. In SV loading, no impact factor or congestion effects are considered. It assumes ideal loading without dynamic amplification. However, in non-SV loading, both impact factor and congestion effects are considered. It reflects real-world traffic scenarios, including dynamic effects. Fourth, vehicle configuration. In SV loading, a single unit of the vehicle is taken for analysis. However, in non-SV loading, multiple vehicles are considered. Here, for Class 70R, loading 30 meters clearance between vehicles is considered, and for Class A loading, 18.5 meters clearance between vehicles is taken. Five, eccentricity from the center of the carriageway. In SV loading, the load is considered to be 0.3 meters away from the center of the carriageway. In non-SV loading, different eccentricities are considered for each loading. For Class 70R, loading 1.2 meters from the curb face, and for Class A loading, 0.15 meters from the curb face is considered. Sixth load combination. In SV loading, only one special vehicle is analyzed. However, in non-SV loading load combinations are determined as per Table 6 of IRC 6, which specifies various loading scenarios involving Class 70R and Class A vehicles together or separately for bridge design.